Such a fragile thing, I know. And with the winter comes the ice, the snow. But I'm it all. And oh my love, don't worry about the cold just yet. The trees haven't started to shed. Just feel the summer sun as it warms our bed. I'm lying and I'm lying. first but good evening with this bag being on my back that means that we are off for a Christmas wild camp I haven't actually done one in a couple of months and we decided a cold week in December would be a good time so we're in the Ogwen Valley I'm not sure how cold it's going to be it's saying about it's actually about 10 degrees right now I don't think it drops to much more than three tonight as I say, we haven't done one in a while, but really looking forward to it. I've been craving some Ogwin Valley for a couple of months now, and I was just waiting for the crowds from summer to die down. By the looks of things, it hasn't died down, considering it's winter and the sun goes down in half an hour. There are still people everywhere. I'm really shocked. So, well, where the weirdos going up, they're all coming back down. so dramatic but I have never seen anything like this. It is coming up over the mountain before our eyes. set up we've got a sorry if this lighting is crazy as well I'm under the camp light and then Kieran's balancing this on his head for me got a view of the full moon and of Lynn Ogwin which is like radiating the full moon and it looks incredible so now we're just going to test out our new little portable campfire and then um, cook some food I feel tired already it's because it's so dark but it's actually only six o'clock
taken off. And it popped up over the mountains. It's quite blind now, actually. Very pretty. down that mountain it now feels really cold because we're out of the sun as well this may not be our best idea but it will certainly give us a new burst of energy hard to resist got me looking like this like the one before because i must be strong because this might go on 